Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel once again. So today I decided to film this look for you guys and I'm absolutely in love with this eyeshadow, you guys. I used the Kylie Cosmetics um, Rose Gold Cream Eyeshadow and just look at how gorgeous that looks on the eyes, you guys. I am in love with it. Um, and I did pair it with the Kylie Cosmetics Dulce K Liquid Lipstick. I am seriously in love with it as well because it is my first time trying this color and i just love it i feel like this is gonna be like my everyday um my go-to liquid lipstick um but yeah i feel like this eye look is just so so gorgeous you guys um if you guys were able to get your hands on this lucky you because it's just so gorgeous and if you weren't i'm so sorry but uh, I just fell in love with it. So yeah, I really hope you guys enjoyed this look. Before you leave, don't forget to hit the subscribe button for future videos. Also, be sure you like this video. And if you guys have any suggestions of any videos you guys would like me to do, then just go ahead and leave them in the comments below. I am always reading your guys' comments. But yeah, without further ado, let's just get on to this makeup tutorial. So starting off by priming my face, I'm going to go in with the Benefit Professional. This is one of my favorites to hide all those pores because I do tend to have some very large pores. So I'm just working this where I mainly have them. Moving on to foundation, I am taking my Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation. And this has become one of my favorites, you guys, for like going out because it's super full coverage. And it just, oh, I love this foundation. You guys definitely recommend it for you guys on the lookout. Um, for a good foundation. It's just amazing <laughs> um, Moving on to concealer. I'll be using the Too Faced Born This Way concealer um, I'm using this underneath my eyes on the bridge of my nose in between the eyebrows and then a little bit on the chin as well um, I really like this concealer because it's like covers the under eyes very well and I don't notice a lot of creasing so that's really good as well and I like to get my concealers light because I like the brightening effect as well so then just I'm just blending it out with like a big tapered um, brush now to set the concealer I'll be using my airspun loose face powder this is one of my favorites loose face powders was well, actually the only one that I own the only one that I've tried but if you guys know of any good ones please let me know in the comments below because I am on the lookout and then for bronzer I'll be taking my benefit hula bronzer and I'm just gonna go ahead and bronze up my cheeks um, and we'll con I'm pr pretty much contouring my cheeks um, and then I will be um, cleaning up underneath my bronzer so that I c it can look very nice and sharp. So now moving on to blush, I will be using this Too Faced Love Flush Blush and it's in the shade Baby Love and it's this is probably one of my favorites so far. And I'm just applying that, you know, to my cheeks as usual. For highlighter, I'll be using the Mary Luminizer by The Balm. And you guys, this has become one of my favorites, favorite um, highlighters because it, like, it's just so gorgeous on there. Like, look at that highlight, you guys. Oh my gosh. Definitely try this highlighter if you guys have not already. So I'm going to take this large stippling brush from Wet n Wild to dust off the excess um, powder and also just to blend everything together just so it doesn't look so harsh on the face. But now we're going to move on to the eyes. I'm taking my Too Faced Chocolate Bonbons palette and I'm taking the shade Almond Truffle. I'm pretty sure that's what it's called. Um, and I'm using this as my transition color and I'm focusing more on the pinks because I am doing like a pink eyeshadow look. So just go ahead and use this on your crease and make sure you blend it out very nicely. So then going in with this pink, very light pink color, I don't know the name of it, but it's a, the very p light pink. And I'm going to also focus this onto the crease with a smaller fluffy brush and I feel like this is going to really help the colors blend because the color that I'm going to go in with my eyelid is very very shimmery um, but take your big fluffy brush and then just make sure you blend everything out just so you don't have any harsh lines so now going in with the fun part you guys um, there's the Kylie Cosmetics um, rose gold cream eyeshadow it is gorgeous um, just go ahead and use your finger and apply this all over your eyelid and just look at that pigmentation you guys i am in love with this eyeshadow
all right so now going back in with almond truffle make sure you take that into the crease and just blend out the colors very nicely and i did go back in with a light shimmery color because i feel like it was gonna help me blend out the two colors you know because it's shimmery and shimmery and i feel like it just helped me blend out the colors very nice So now moving on to eyeliner, I'll be taking my Too Faced um, Liquid Eyeliner. This is in the color black and I feel like um, I'm still trying to get used to this eyeliner. You guys know I'm used to my gel liner, but I still made it work, you guys. I still got my winged eyeliner. For mascara, I took my Maybelline The Falsies Push-Up Drama. This has become one of my favorites at the moment. So just go ahead and curl your lashes because we will be applying some falsies. The ones that I use today are the Kiss Lashes in the style Flirty and I apply those off camera. Moving on to eyeliner for the waterline, I'm taking the Maybelline Skinny Eyeliner, I think it's called or something like that. And then going back into the um, Chocolate Bonbons palette, take the, sh the shade Almond Truffle and just go ahead and blend that underneath your lower lash line. And then going in with this big shimmery color, I'm using this as my inner corner highlight and also as my brow highlight. So lastly for the lips, I'll be taking this Kylie Cosmetics liquid lipstick in the shade Dulce K. It's super gorgeous, you guys. But then after that, this look is complete. I really hope everyone enjoyed this look. I seriously love this eyeshadow. So I really hope you guys liked it. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. And I will talk to you guys in my next video. Bye!